Hey guys, King XC here, and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to install the voxel map mod alongside of Optifine for Minecraft 1.8, and we're going to be installing it using Forge and Lightloader. So the first thing you guys are going to want to do is go into the first link in the description, this should take you to Minecraft Forge, and then you're going to want to scroll down until you see Download Latest, and press Installer to, to download the latest version of Minecraft Forge. The next step, we're going to the second link in the description, this should take you to the Lightloader page, Simply press Lightloader Installer.exe and this will download the Lightloader Installer for you. In the third step, go into the third link in the description. This should take you to Curse Forge. Scroll down until you see Voxel Map for Minecraft 1.8. Press this right here and this will download Voxel Map for you. In the fourth step, go into the fourth link in the description. This should take you to the Optifine page where you're just going to press Download Optifine 1.8 and this will download Optifine for you. Once you've downloaded all four files, drag them onto your desktop or somewhere where you can access them and open up Forge. For sake, my Windows 10 has like bugged out the icon. It's like, it says it's Java, but it's actually like .winrar. Um, so, go on Open With and then make sure you select Java. If this option is not available here, then go into Google and just download the latest version of Java. Alright, when this pops up, make sure you select Install Client and then press OK. Alright, Forge has been installed on Minecraft, I'm going to open up Minecraft and actually set up Forge properly. So here, go into Profile Selection, select Forge, go into Edit Profile, make sure you have the right version of Forge, because for those of you who have previously installed Forge, make sure your mod folder is empty when you're doing this, else your Minecraft will crash. So press play. Three mods loaded, as you can see, Forge has been installed successfully. You can now quit game and then install Lightloader. So open up your Lightloader installer and then press on Extend From, then select Forge, then press OK. Alright, it's been linked together. Lightloader and Forge have been installed together. So now we're going to set this up. So we we'll go once again in your profile selection, select Lightloader with Forge this time. Then press the button. Alright. Uh, as Minecraft has not crashed, there seems to be no problem and Lightloader has been set up. We can press quit game. And now we're going to install both the mods. So, hold the Windows key in your keyboard and press R. And then this should open up Run and it will do the same for Windows 7, 8, 8.1 and 10. As I've said in the description below. And that then type in percent app data percent forward slash dot minecraft and then press ok and this will take you directly to your minecraft directory then go into mods drag in the light loader file and then optify you can turn this off i'm going to launch minecraft and show you guys that the mods have been successfully installed <laughs> Three mods loaded, but as you can see, it says Optifine here, and Forge doesn't detect light mods. Remember that. So let's go into single player and load this new, this new world that I've created earlier. I'm going to show you guys that everything has been installed fine, and there's no problem at all. So Optifine allows you to even have this little FPS counter in the corner here. I've enabled that. As you can see, Optifine has been installed. You have all the settings that it comes with. And press done, done. Then, as you can see in the top right corner, the voxel map is there. If you press M, it opens up a map of everything, of, well, of all the places you've been. E each one of these is a chunk. So, thanks for watching, guys. I hope this has helped you. If it hasn't, make sure you guys leave a comment down below and I'll try to help you out as soon as possible. <laughs> and if you think anyone else could benefit from this tutorial, make sure you guys share it around with your friends. I have plenty of other tutorials on all sorts of mods. So, thank you for watching. I hope this has helped and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.